In this video, let us solve word problems based on simultaneous linear equations. So what we have to do is we need to apply the concepts of simultaneous linear equations in these problems. So these problems are going to make us make equations which are going to be linear equations in two variables. And that's how we are going to solve these problems and find the solutions. So we've got a question here which says 37 pens and 53 pencils together cost rupees 320. While 53 pens and 37 pencils together cost rupees 400. Find the cost of a pen and that of a pencil. Well, this is a very straightforward and a simple problem. Not really, you know, we, we, we don't have to break our heads. Now, how do you approach this problem? Now here, you see the pens and the pencils are the variables here. All right, the pens and the pencils are the variables. And the number of pens and the number of pens, uh, pencils in both the cases are the constants like A1, B1 and A2, B2. And then the total rupees is C1 and C2. That's how you got a C. So say, when I meant the pens and the pencils are the variables, I meant the cost of the pens and the pencils. So now, let the cost of a pen be rupees X and that of a pencil b rupees y then now assuming the cost of a pen to be rupees x and that of a pencil to be y we definitely have so 37 pens multiplied by the cost of one pen plus 53 pencils multiplied by the cost of one pencil should give definitely give us 320 rupees right similarly 53 pens multiplied by the cost of each pen plus 37 pencils multiplied by the cost of each pencil should give 400 rupees. So now this is the way you form the simultaneous linear equations in two variables. So this is how you do it. So now the problem ends the moment you solve these equations correctly because the amount of equations that we've solved now it's not a big deal for us to find the values of x and y we've got a number of methods we've got the substitution method we've got the elimination method we've got the cross multiplication method we've got the graphical method and so on so all that you have to do and all that is important in word problems based on simultaneous linear equations is to analyze the problem you know make something x and y and then make these equations once it's done it's done so now let us see how do we solve this problem. So what we'll do is uh, we will solve this problem. So now how are we going to solve this simultaneous equation? Now there are a number of methods to solve, but you know, looking at the numbers, the methods that we know are definitely going to take some time for us to calculate. Now what we'll do is let's name this as equation one and this is equation two. Now there is another simple method to solve simultaneous linear equations which have got such big numbers so what we have to do is the first step is add 1 and 2 so when you add 1 and 2 what you get is 37x plus 53x is 90x plus 53y plus 37y is again 90y uh, 320 plus 400 is uh, 720 so 90 is same in everything 90 is a factor of 720 as well so Taking out 90, we get x plus y. Or dividing throughout by 90, we get x plus y equals 90 times 8 is 720. So we get one equation, which is x plus y equals 8. So we've simplified it. Now, next step, what we'll do is, let us subtract equation 2 minus equation 1. So 53x minus 37x is exactly 16x minus 16y. 37 minus 53 is minus 16y. 400 minus 320 is exactly 80. So now 16 is a common. So dividing throughout by 16, we get x minus y equals 16 goes 5 times an 80. So we've got two of these equations. Now what we can do is, now we can use the method of elimination or whatever that you want. So we've got x plus y equals 8 and x minus y equals 5. So we can simply add these equations. y and y gets cancelled. We get x plus x is 2x. 8 plus 5 is 13, so x equals 13 by 2, which is 6.5. Therefore, x equals rupees 6.5. So what the cost of a pen is 6 rupees and 50 paise. So the next thing is we need to find the value of y. 
substituting the value of x in this x plus y equals 8. So we get 6.5 plus y equals 8 y equals 8 minus 6.5 so y equals 1.50 y equals rupees 1 rupee and 50 paise so this is the cost of one pencil so the cost of one pen is rupees 6 rupees 50 paise and the cost of a pencil is rupees uh, 1 rupee 50 paise so that's all this ends this problem as well as this video pretty straightforward problem so as I've told you before, the main thing that we have to do in word problems based on simultaneous linear equations is to read the question and form the equations. And then it just comes down to solving the simultaneous linear equations by any one of the methods that we've already known. And also add to it this new method, which is going to help us solve simultaneous linear equations containing big numbers like this to save us time from calculating and all those things. So I'll see you in the forthcoming videos with more word problems based on simultaneous linear equations.